Okay, here's how Logan can do his uh, first independent task in Zoom with VoiceOver. So I have a Zoom meeting open here and he needs to turn on VoiceOver. He can do that with Siri or with the triple click the home button. I wanna show you both and, and there's one that I prefer. So if we use Siri, turn on VoiceOver. Okay, I turned on VoiceOver. Home button to the right. Now I need to tap the home button again to get um, out of the screen. Zoom. Displaying just. Turn off voiceover. Okay. Voiceover off. I turned off voiceover. If he uses the triple click home, then it eliminates the need to tap the home button again. So. Oops. Try that again. Okay. Zoom. And then triple click home button. One, two. Voice over on, landscape, home button to the right, zoom, displaying Jessica McDowell's video. Okay, so now I'm going to drag around and find the elements. Um, we really just focused on this top bar and Logan got oriented to the items up there and can move around them and find mute and stop video. Those are his first um, independent tasks. So what that sounds like is, Leave. Display leave button. Displaying Jessica. You are using a Zoom button. Displaying Jessica. Mute my audio. Stop my video. Share content. Participant more button. And of course, when he finds the item he wants, he can double tap, and that double tap can be anywhere on the screen. Stop mute my audio button. Audio now muted. Displaying just stop my video button. Video now stopped. Okay. You can also swipe between these elements. Unmute my audio. But audio now on. Start my video. Video now started. Okay. And then, of course, you can turn off voiceover either with Siri or with the same triple click the home button. Voiceover off. 